In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to convert an image into vector artwork in Illustrator. Over here we have an image of a car opened up in Illustrator. What we will do is trace parts of the image using the pen tool. We will first lock this layer and create a new layer in the document. This is so that we can easily trace over the image. With that done, let's select the pen tool and start tracing the side windows over here. What you would want to do is simply add anchor points over the image, like so. When dealing with curves, you have to keep the mouse click pressed while moving the cursor. It will automatically form a curve according to the movement of the cursor. Now let's cover the second window in the same way. With that done, let's trace over the tail light and the spoiler over here. Notice that in the image we cannot see the rear windshield, but since the illustration would be a two-dimensional artwork, let's recreate it by simply tracing over the background image like so. With that done, we will trace over the front windshield, headlights, and the number plate at the front as well. Lastly, we will pick up the ellipse tool and draw over the tire. With that done, let's create another circle and position it in the middle of the bigger circle. With that done, let's move to the Pathfinder window and first we will exclude the two circles. Now let's copy this and place it over the other tire. Once the tracing is done, you can hide the image layer from the layer panel. Select all the shapes and let's change its color to F15A29. You can now see the outline of the car that we have traced. Let's use the type tool to write the name of the company in caps using the Broadway font. For the tagline over here, we will use the Guatami font. We will position both the text between the two tires like so. With that done, let's change their color to orange as well. Now let's pick up the rectangle tool from the toolbar and draw a rectangle larger than the shape of the car. Right click on the rectangle, move to Arrange, and click on the Send to Back option. With that done, let's change its color to gray. And there you have it, an image of a car has been turned into a vector artwork in Illustrator. Thanks for watching. This was a howtech.tv tutorial.